unboxing. Um, I just received all of this stuff in the mail. I just did a good size order off of Ulta. Um, they had a lot of good stuff like in, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I guess like boxes stuff like they have around the holidays already. Um, so like this thing here, this, um, uh, what's it called? Dolly Darling is a thing from Benefit and it's a hundred and, or no, it's $91 value, um, but it's only $39. So everything in here is full size, I think, except for one product is like a deluxe sample. Um, so let's open this up. But this has a lot of good products in it here. Um, you have their roller lash mascara then you have the hula bronzer which is why one of the really good reasons i wanted this because i wanted this for a while then you have their professional um primer and then another new product of theirs which i'm really excited to try out is the give me that's not new this is their new um little eh, new packaging but this is the give me brow um for the volumizing fiber gel for your eyebrows so I'm really excited to try this out and then the bronzer in here is just their Hoola bronzer so I'm very excited about this I've wanted the Hoola bronzer for a while and I'm losing things out of this but I've just never purchased it and I thought this was a really good time too because I got a really good deal and Thor is going to eat the brush no dog no and eat it. That's not for you. Why is it wet? What did you do? No, get down. Don't eat this stuff. And then here you ow. And then here you have a full size of the professional um, primer. I really, really like this stuff. It's great. I don't have that large of pores. I have more problems right in here on my face, so this is where usually where I apply it. Um, but it works really, really well, and I do really like this primer. Then I have got the Roller Lash Mascara. I have yet to try this, so I'm really excited to try this out. I've seen a lot of other YouTubers use it and they've said a lot of great things. It's supposed to be for curling and lifting mascara. So I'm really excited to try this out as well. Then I'm also really excited about this palette right here. It's the Urban Decay um, Vice palette. LEDT Reloaded. So this is the Vice. I guess that's 20 in my lip. Size 2. I think that's supposed to be 2. This right now is on sale. I don't know if it's going to stay that way, uh, but it's on this under the sale section at Ulta. Um, it's normally like $56, and right now it's like $34, I think, or $32. So I'm really excited about this. I've noticed um, they've been doing that a lot, like the, uh, the Gwen Stefani one that I have. I paid full price for it, and then it wasn't long after that. They marked it down to half price. So I decided whenever this came out to wait and see if they did the same, and they did. So I'm really excited that I got this palette. Um, it has a lot of great eyeshadows in it. They're very, very pretty, very pigmented. I'm really liking these greens here. So I'm really excited to try out an eyeshadow tutorial with those. Um, and then you have, like, your purples and this blue shade there. So I'm really excited to try this out. These colors are very pretty and I love Urban Decay. I know they're going to be very pigmented and a great palette, especially since I got this half off. Makes me even more excited. Then you just have your samples, which is another professional primer and another primer by Smashbox, which I always get every time I do samples through this. Then this here is an eye mask. Um, I have really bad allergies and at night, especially like right now and then this ring time, 
my eyes get really bad and super itchy in the evening um, and I always have to put like a cold washcloth on them and I figured this would be really good because I can just throw this in like the fridge or the freezer and then place it on my eyes whenever I'm sleeping instead of having a washcloth like fall off and get the sheets wet and not know where it's going this can just like you know go around my head and actually stay there in place and also it's supposed to help with the bags under your eyes my allergies seem to cause that really badly whenever my eyes are irritated so I figured it would help kill two birds with one stone and it will stay in place and not fall over and it was only I think eight dollars so to see if it works that's not too bad I don't think at all um, I did notice when I already took it out of the package and my husband did as well it's really kind of heavy um, so for that I don't know how it's gonna feel like laying on my face at night because of all the beads that are in here I think that's what makes it so heavy but we'll see how it turns out then I ordered the L'Oreal mask and this product is not new to me I have it already but it's the L'Oreal carbon black telescopic mascara uh, they were L'Oreal products were buy one get one half off so I ordered this as a backup because I have one but I've had it for a while so I need to get a new one pretty soon. Um, so I'm just going to sit that over here. But this product I have not tried yet. I've heard a lot of great things about this pure clay mask. Um, I've heard a lot of people kind of compare it to the, and my mind's going blank. I've heard a lot of people compare this to the Glam Glow um, mask. So I'm really excited to try this out. I believe it also is around $11, so it's a lot cheaper than Glam Glow, if it's worth it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Let's see here. Ooh. But it's just black like that on the inside. There is a little bit of a scent to it. Um, it actually smells pretty good. It doesn't stink, so I like that. It says on the on for 10 to 15 minutes, remove with water for best results, use three times a week. So it's supposed to just kind of, I think, clean out and purify your skin. So I'm definitely getting excited to give this a try. Then I ordered the Tarte High Performance Naturals Colored Clay Under Eye Corrector Concealer. This um, was on sale. It was one of their special items that's like half price, was I think $15 or $12. Using a concealer brush, apply under corrected clay, under corrector, front, inner, and outer eye corners, near the lash line, or wherever you see darkness. Use fingers to pat and smooth for instantly awakened radiant eyes. I got light medium, and I think there was a medium dark. I don't, I think there was only two shades for this. But this is what the inside of it looks like. It's very creamy, actually. You can see there, it's just a little bit lighter than my actual skin tone, and that feels very creamy on my skin. I wasn't for sure how I would like this, because I usually use like liquid concealers under my eyes, and I need nothing like this, um, but I really like the way that feels on my skin, so I'm interested to give that a try. Then I also got this for under the eyes, and it's the Smashbox Photo Op Under Eye Brightener Illuminator. Um... This is supposed to banish dark circles with vitamin pack formula, awaken and brighten tired eyes with good for your skin like mineral, vitamin E, red wine extract, and peptide. Wear alone or apply under concealer. So I got this in the shade. I don't know. I can see a shade. Let me see if it's on the inside. It might have just been one shade. I think that's all there was on this one actually. This was another one, it was like $12, it was one of their special buys. And this will be different for me, I've never used like anything, I don't know if this has shimmer in it or not, but I've never used anything like illuminating under the eyes, except for like a highlight. Yeah, this does look like it has a little bit of shimmer. So, but that seems to be kind of like the new thing, like I've noticed, um, Bare Minerals has like an illuminating thing now, like. It's not really shimmery though. I think it's more of just a highlight maybe. So maybe it's not a real shimmer. So that I have used. I do do highlight under my eyes. But it's also just a little bit lighter. You can't really see it because it matches my skin tone. So, but I like the way that feels as well. It doesn't feel sticky or anything. It's just very smooth on the back of my hand. Then the last thing in this box is this from Honest Beauty. 
I have seen um, some commercials and some things. I always see it in their ad for Ulta, and I've wanted to try it out ever since it came out. Um, this is like the test, um, oh no, it's the travel kit sample that I got. Um, it was on sale as well. Everything I got was on sale. I feel like everything I got was on sale, at least 50% off. They had a lot of good sales this month going on. I think they're getting ready for Christmas and all, maybe a lot of new products coming out. Um, but this, I got the one, they have an oily skin, a dry skin, and balanced skin. So I got the one for balanced skin. It comes with, um, looks like four steps. Um, it says, use your cleanser with yucca, yucca, yucca root extract. Um, provides a fresh and foamy cleanse experience to remove dirt and makeup. Close eyes to go to your happy place and spray hydration, elevated hydration, replenish mist directly onto face and neck with aloe vera conditioning skin and hydraulic acids look in hydration. Mist away through the day out is needed, so if you need more, you can use that. Gently my massage, even brightener, everyday moisturizer onto skin. Um, it helps to balance an even skin tone. Use day and night to stay bright. And then step four, daytime only. Says to shake first. Um, beyond protectant day beauty fluid. SPF 30. And apply evenly onto face and neck. Hydrating hydraulic acid and non-nano zinc oxide. Mineral based broad spectrum sunscreen. Helps to prevent signs of premature aging. You've got, we've got you covered. And it comes in this cute little like travel kit. I've been wanting to try out some new um, like skincare routines and skincare products. So that's why I wanted to get this and try it and see. This also has the magic balm in it, which is something that I really wanted to try. Um, but here is your cleansing gel, and these are just travel size tubes. Keep that in mind. And then your replenishing mist, so this will be your second step, and then your everyday brightener, that is really, really small, that's not going to last very long, um, and then your daily beauty fluid, that's not going to last very long either, and then you have the magic balm in here as well, and this was not on there, but it says use liberally, liberally everywhere, avoid contacts with eyes. And this is just a balm, and I think it's, from what I read online, it's supposed to, you can apply it like everywhere, and it's supposed to kind of help give you like an all natural highlight all over your face, um, from what I understand. And this is supposed to be like a really, really good product. So this is what I honestly really wanted to try out, but we'll see how I like the balm because it's going to be a little bit different than what I would normally be used to applying to my face. But it feels like really, really, it's really smooth and really soft. So I'm excited to try. I don't like the smell. There's not really a smell. It almost has like that. You know when something doesn't have a smell, but it kind of stinks? I don't know how to explain that. That probably didn't make any sense whatsoever, but that's how that smells. So I'm excited to try these products out and see how I like them, maybe get some new skincare products um, and if we like these. But that is all I have for you guys today in this haul that I have. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to check back later in the week to see more and hit that thumbs up button if you like this video. Please don't get, forget to subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye bye.